In this short video, we'll be looking at how to configure your LG WebOS 3 display to connect with Sarnage Live from its out-the-box state. We're using an LG SM5C display with a wired network connection. We also have the remote control to access the menus, and we're using a USB keyboard to type. When your display powers on, you'll be asked to select the language, continent, and country you wish to configure your display for before pressing OK. Your display will return to the source menu and you should now hold down the settings button for 5 seconds. You'll see the chat bubble appear in the top right corner and at this point you'll need to press the following on your remote control 8080OK. OK. You'll now be taken to the server settings menu. Scroll to the application launch mode and select local. Now select fully qualified domain name and turn this option on before scrolling to the URL entry bar, where you should type the WebOS specific Signage Live Player URL using either your remote control or the attached USB keyboard. Now select Local Application Upgrade and change this to Remote before confirming this change and pressing OK when prompted. You can now turn your panel off and on again. When your panel powers back on, after a short while, you'll see the message Start to Upgrade Application before the message to say This is complete. You'll then be shown the Signage Live Settings menu where you can choose the application time zone, screen rotation, and the ability to enable or disable remote firmware updates. Save your changes and your Signage Live player will register, download its content and shortly show you the six digit activation code required to activate your player. This should then be activated on your Signage Live network using one of your active licenses and when the player next successfully performs its content check, you'll see the green tick appear to let you know your display has been successfully connected to Signage Live. 